You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Make sure you subscribe to the channel to stay in tune with all the latest content. Got my dog with me. Showtime SP. The nobody that knows bodies. Uh-huh. I'm riding till they get me. Riding till they get me. Uh -huh. Next battle, Geechee Gotti versus Big T. Oh. Um, Geechee Gotti versus Big T going down on this charity card. On the same card that Hollow the Don uh -huh. versus Danny Myers is going down on. Uh -huh. Um, be honest with you. Geechee Gotti, you know, he's been doing his thing. He's had a lot of battles this year. And now he's going into one probably will be one of his final battles this year. I couldn't see him being on a volume. So he's probably he probably won't be on volume five. Uh -huh. I mean he it's a stretch. But to see him on battling on one weekend and turn around and doing the next weekend, he could do it. How about he's say, a stretch exactly. where he's done it like yeah. three weeks in a row. Mm -hmm. But uh him versus Big T, what you think? I mean that's ran random. Random Super random. Random. Um do I think that Big T deserves to get Gichi Gotti? Oh wait, I should have said that backwards, but no, that's actually right. That's that's right. That's yeah. about right now. I mean, I don't know. Big T is known to, to be unorthodox. Mm -hmm. His uh the way that he performs and the way that he writes. Mm -hmm. It, it it is it it don't sound smart as shit, but the way the the way he does his bars, we would think it's some retarded shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I remember the old Big T. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But when's the last time we seen the last remnants of that Big T? What mm -hmm. Danger Zone? That was mm -hmm. the last time I seen Big T actually smoke something. Mm -hmm. Um, he beat he beat Twerk, but Twerk didn't have any rounds. No, he showed up with nothing. Like he had nothing. So <laughs> you didn't have a, a screeching a squeak and a squirt and a street and a street. Well, he did ever remember Jack Boy, he had Jack Boy. Yeah, I mean and Jack Boy won. Right? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Let's just get to the book. Yeah. Listen, Big T, I'ma be honest with you. Good. I, you know I got at you, and when I got at you, I added you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I didn't I didn't do the little, you know how some people will talk about a battler and then not at them, mm -hmm. I at you with the at you That's big to let you know that uh, if we get a big T that performed like you did versus Sue Surf, mm. remember when I added you that mm. and, and then when you said that, when you said what you said about your announcement, I knew who you had. So that's why I acted you mm. to let you know if we get a performance like you versus Sue Surf, yeah, okay, the Lipton, yeah, uh huh, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, that. Yeah. That's the reason why we, we do the things that we do to, to, to motivate the people that we want to motivate. I mean, but I feel as though that all of that motivation aside, you going to... Me and Big T have came a long way. We went from having each other blocked, so now we both follow each other on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? So it's, been, a rev it's been a rev revolution. But, um, so... <laughs> Big T versus New Jersey Twerk. I mean, Big T versus <laughs> New Jersey Twerk. Why am I saying New Jersey Twerk? Because that's the nigga who blocked me. Anyway, we not throwing no shots. Big T versus Geechee Gotti. Come on now. Are we being serious here? He's just going to add one more word in the middle of his slogan. He's just going to say, use a fat bitch. That's all they're going to say. You know what I'm saying? Mm. It's going to be fire. He will have 80,000 80, fat jokes. But then again, how many fat jokes have we heard against Big T? Just is about big, all of them? Just, yeah, I mean, just about. And mm -hmm. for Geechee Gotti to be different, mm -hmm. I don't think that Geechee Gotti is going to come different unless he talks about, you know, Big T getting shot. But we already heard that before. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, what can Geechee bring to the table? And I just think he's going to bring three straight rounds that was catered towards Big T. Mm -hmm. But it's up to Big T to shock the world. It's, it's, it's a little bit open because of that motivation. Like, Geechee does not have the motivation for Big T. I'm almost certain. Uh... I would say he does because Geechee Gotti don't get a lot of home games. And I know that was one of the things that was high on his list of things to do is to get some URL home games yeah. where he's battling. Because the reason why you got to remember, Geechee Gotti is able to travel the world. He's mm -hmm. able to go battle in New York and California. I mean, in, in Florida, North Carolina. He's battled a lot Texas. of places, right? Yeah. The people that he really hold nearest and dearest to him mm -hmm. can't travel. A lot of them people can't leave the state. Don't a probation things like that. Can't leave the state, issues, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, he wants nothing more but to have a home game. That's why he did the town business and shit like that. Yeah. Because he want to have home games for his people that's there to be able to see him. It's fair so enough. with that being said, he's not gonna show up and play with Big T. He's not about to play with no Big T. I can guarantee you that right now. 
the Geechee guy that we've been getting all year. Mm -hmm. is the, and you just seen him versus Don Marino, who's way lower on the totem pole. Yeah. Did he play with Don Marino yeah. at all? He did, he not, did not play with no Don Marino. No. So when I see that, I just don't see him playing with no Big T either. I got um, Geechee Gotti winning this battle 2-1, if not 3-0. And I hope Big T sees this and uses his motivation, you know what I'm saying, before you use the appropriation and say that you know we hating, use this as motivation. Mm. Who you got? Uh, yeah, I, I also have uh, Gigi Gotti winning this uh, two one, um, and I don't want to say it's a sympathy round, but the first round Big T is usually the most shocking. Mm. You know what I'm saying? The second rounds from Big T aren't as good, and the third rounds we sometimes don't even get all of it because of you know because of his opponents too. But I don't know. I'm gonna just go oh, go ahead. You're good. I I don't know. It, it's kind of hard. It's kind of hard. Big T is in the rock. He's he's in between a rock and a hard place. He could be considered the worst member of NWX. Whereas, you know what I'm saying? Like, and everybody else on NWX is like winning. One of one member who is considered lower than Big T as far as name wise has already battled Gigi Gotti, mm. and that's Don Marino. Mm. So, <laughs> officials out here knocking niggas, knocking women's heads off. So. Big T, like what you got to do? What you what, that should be more motivation than anything. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, there is there was a Big T versus Sue Surf. Mm -hmm. There was a Big T versus Kayshawn. Mm -hmm. There was Big T. Well, he he lost against Hollow, but you know it, it's not it's besides the point. Mm -hmm. Big T gets names. He has cooked right. and has killed. But what have you done for us lately, right now? That's what I'm saying. Like. I, I mean, I can't pick him to beat a Geechee Gotti who's been doing what Geechee Gotti has been doing all year. Yeah. You know, a lot. But the thing is, a lot of people's gonna count Big T out. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like he knows that he's been doing this for a long time. He knows a lot of people are gonna count him out. But then, what you gonna do with that? Are you gonna use that as the the the, the motivation to get you where you need to go and yeah. to, to get busy versus a Geechee Gotti? Mm -hmm. He should. Yeah. I mean, you're going to the West Coast, so you're automatically at a disadvantage. Yep. Like, I don't know nobody that's going to really pick you to win this battle. You know what I'm saying? Because you're going to the West Coast, you're going to battle him in his backyard. Yeah. He's been dangerous all over the country. Yeah, it don't Let matter him. where you're at. Don't matter. So, don't matter. Geechee is known to pop whoever, whenever, wherever. And just like you said, he does not mind being on every fucking card. Right. And he's still going to give you three rounds. Had, when has Geechee choked? Okay. I mean, he had minor slip-ups here and there, but no chokes. No chokes, right? No, no, no. Damn, damn, no. Give me my water. No, no, none of that. Big T's biggest battle of his career, the Battle of Chicago, him versus Big Cannon. What happened? Okay. I got you. I'm just saying, T, get your shit together, man. And that was past tense. Mm. You you got to have a slogan like chess if you, if you, if, if you want us to believe you, T. Even mm. though I do like a... I do like uh, uh, the the single he had for a while. Let me shoot my shot. Let me shoot my shot. And, and, you know he he does make really good music. Big T got oh, music some, is his good. music is fire. Okay, Gigi yeah. got to make good music too. I don't know. See now, now we, oh god, I, T, you gotta you gonna have to kill this nigga. Yeah, I'm sorry. You gonna you gonna have to do something. You gonna have to do something. Yeah, man, you gonna definitely have to do something. <laughs> because, uh, <laughs> it, it, looking at the and this is just preliminary. The tail of the tape is the not looking good. Like it does not look good. You no. have them by weight. That's about it. That's it. <laughs> like, and I, you know what? I knew they were battling a couple of days ago when Big T he made a post about something saying like he goes to like eat by himself and Gigi got it retweeted and said we've been knew that or something like that. When I saw that, I was like. Hmm. hmm. Things yeah. that make you go. Hmm. I got you. I was like, cause you know, it's like wrestling where these guys, their storylines, if they don't got one, they'll make one. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They'll and build it up. One guy will just go start dissing the other person, and he's like, yeah, one day Gucci said, like, one day I'm gonna get you out of here too, and etc. I was like, yeah, it might be. It's gonna happen soon. Yeah. Um, but what I will say is Gucci got him. If he sleeps on Big T, doesn't bring three full rounds, like really prepared, uh, gives him a half-ass performance just because. It's not a crazy legend or nothing like that. He could easily lose because, like you said, like we, a lot of people would have never thought that Big T would have beat New Jersey Twerk, and he yeah. clearly beat him. Yeah. So I feel like this: if Big T comes and gives us what we want, mm -hmm. 
We got to give him his respect. Yeah, we need, you know the, we need, we need the, the salsa with the papa. Hit him with the two with the cucarachas. Them two more group of blockers. You know what I'm saying? I need, I need, I need all of that, but I also need the bars to be in the two. I don't know. I don't know. I because we know what T is capable of. Yeah, just give me what I'm. Give us what we used to. You give us what we used to. I got no, ob I got mm -hmm. no, ob no problem with it. Mm -hmm. If Big T gives us what we used to, what I'm used to from back in the days, not the what I'm used to with the Fruit Loops and the Blue Blue, like none of the new. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! I was there. I was cooking with you. I, I like cooking it. With I you. like hey, it. Hey, I hey, like man. it, man. Give me what I'm used to, mm -hmm. man. Let two shoot from the new cool. Go blue, blue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need that. Mm -hmm. Give me, get, give me what I want. Two you know missiles on the rock and Yeah, <laughs> man. You already know what it do and what it does, so you gotta ask what it was.